Hello, I'm David, I'm Lindsay, and this is Desmond Stonders. Welcome to Desmond Stonders and a photo diary of our trip to Findlata Castle. We start with the sunset and visit the castle and Lindsay visits the inside of the castle on this trip. Diary, 24th of June 2021 Lindsay is working again this Saturday and I am headed off to Finlata Castle and getting some more chilling time. The weather forecast is not good, it looks like the wind and rain until Saturday. I'm sure I'll survive. On arrival it is a little busy but there is room for me. I got parked up and went and up went the antennas. Kettle on and cameras as out I surveyed the area. The cars left one by one until I was left alone with the wind and rain. No video and only one photo on the phone. I'm not going out in tonight's weather so time to read and relax with some music and then off to bed. Twenty fifth of June, twenty twenty one. Another day of wind and rain forecast. Looking out of the window makes me agree with the forecast. I have managed to jury rig an HF antenna after last night's fell down in the wind. I'm using the wall and the fencing so I can get on the HF bands. VHF and DMR are quiet today, but HF was busy on seventeen, twenty, and forty at least. I read a lot and went online some. There are more birds about today and I did manage some video from inside the van. The car park was again busy with dog walkers and some hikers and the rain did stop but the wind kept up all night. Lindsay called then time for bed. Around midnight a van pulled into the car park. One of those with a sliding door. You know, the ones they spend around an hour opening and closing constantly. I got up to use the loo and then took a look out. The reason it was so bad, they were parked right next to me in an empty car park. What made it worse, and I suppose technically this could be under tomorrow's, there was another hour of it opening and closing from around 5am until they drove off. I rolled over to get some sleep but gave up on it and read my book for a while. I can say one thing though, the weather will be better tomorrow.
26th of June 2021. Well, after my disturbed night, I'm awake, out of bed, tired and grumpy. After breakfast and a cuppa, I flew the drone and settled down to wait for Lindsay to arrive. Okay, I did a little more than that. The bird species list is growing and there is plenty of coming and going to keep me entertained. I ended up listening to T20 cricket. It's not real cricket, but that's that all is on at the moment. Lindsay arrived and yes, the kettle is on. It was too early for eating, so Lindsay went out later for fish suppers. But we are close to Colin, after all. There are still plenty of people about and some are planning to spend the night on the beach. We're not, not expecting much from the sunset, but I set up the time lapse anyway and set it going. Well, they say expect the unexpected. The clouds cleared a little and we were treated to a spectacular display, which you've seen. I even flew the drone again to capture this sunset. With flying, photos and video, it was after midnight before we got to bed. It's been a long day after my early rise and of course, Lindsay was working. Twenty seventh of June, twenty twenty one. It's overcast and cool to start the day. It soon warms up though. The car park is packed with folk headed for the beach. We drink our tea and head off for the castle. I'm taking the drone, so hopefully I'll get some close ups. We arrive at the viewpoint and take a seat. Lindsay decides she's going to try for the castle while I decide to sit at the viewpoint. Lindsay makes it to the castle and also does what she said she would never do and go inside. Meanwhile, I set up and flew the drone. I had to stay away from the castle, but used the zoom to good effect. Lindsay came back and we set off back to the path towards the car park and lunch. After lunch, Lindsay decides she was off for another walk and I decided to play radio for a while and then drop the antennas. Despite the weather, the start and the packed car park, this has been a great break. When Lindsay came back from a walk, it was time to head for home. We packed up and headed off, leaving a car park that was emptying quickly.
Wildlife White tailed bumblebee Brown hare Field vole Crane fly Pearl bordered fritillary Birds Common gull House sparrow Herring gull Carrion crow Jackdaw Swallow Mallard Lesser black back gull Pied wagtail Rook Linnet Stone chat Red legged partridge Wood pigeon, buzzard, sand martin, tree sparrow, red kite, goldfinch, skylark, starling, blackbird, pheasant, fulmer, cormorant, great black backed gull, yellow hammer. Thank you for watching Desmond's Donners and remember please take nothing but memories and leave nothing but tracks. Please subscribe and ring the bell for notifications and hopefully we'll see you next time.